Welcome to my 11th music update. Here we go again. Today I have five CDs to show you guys. Most of these were in an unboxing video I did recently, but hey, now I get to talk about them even more. This first one was brand new into my collection, so you guys don't know I have it yet. And that is the final Cannibal Corpse album I needed to complete my Cannibal Corpse collection of their album discography. That is Cannibal Corpse's KILL! Oh hell yeah. This is one of their first ones with a really crisp production. It's a very basic album cover, just says KILL on it, but it's a great album. Great songs such as Make Them Suffer, Death Walking Terror, and The Time to Kill is no. The second CD I have is a soundtrack for Friday the 13th, the original motion picture soundtrack. I love this theme. I want to get the rest of them, but not all of them are on CD, which sucks. But Friday the 13th is a great movie, and a really good musical score. My favorites are probably the closing theme slash the boat to the water. Even the song Sail Away Tiny Sparrow is pretty catchy. And the overlay of evil slash main title, Banjo Traveling. That's a great soundtrack. Lots of good themes on here. Then I have Goblins Profundo Russo. AKA Deep Red. Deep Red. It's very bright red on the cover. <laughs> this is a two disc, really cool, amazing soundtrack for a 1975 film. I have all of these that were released by Cinevox or whatever. Really cool. The fourth one I have is Morbid Saints Spectrum of Death. This also comes with their newest album, actually. It is called Destruction System, which is a really good tune that was done in 1992, but it's not released until like 2011 or so. Really good. Thrash metal. Extreme thrash metal, that is. And the final one for this video. It is undoubtedly the most expensive CD I've ever purchased. At a whopping 100 and fifty dollars you may think i'm crazy you may think i'm insane you may think i'm everything that revolves around the word batshit nuts but uh it's wolfen i bought this because i love this musical score i love this movie and james horner is dead i do not know if they'll ever re-release this I just, I had to, man. I've been looking for this for years. I found it for a decent price based on what it's usually worth. It's a great score for a great movie. And it means the world to me that I'm actually holding it in my hands. Everyone has their guilty pleasures. Some people love uh, The Howling too. Some people like an American Werewolf in Paris. I love Wolfen. So that is it. Those are the five CDs I've gotten as of recently. Lion Brian Gatto, host of Horror Show Entertainment. Make sure to like my Facebook page in the description below and leave comments and subscribe.